Good morning, good morning, good morning. We are gonna be prepping and packing for Greece. Um, going on a solo trip for my birthday, and this is the first birthday that I actually will be going on a solo trip. I usually spend my birthday with like friends or family. This is the first birthday that I'm going to be spending alone. But we're gonna get our nails done today because these claws need to be updated, okay? It needs to be upgraded. Um, and oh, one thing that I keep forgetting to do is applying, actually wait for me, <laughs> let me book, let me book the Uber really quickly. Every time you go and get your nails done, don't forget sunscreen, okay? You need sunscreen because you always put it under the UV light and you don't want your hands to wrinkle quickly because, you know, a lot of us go get our nails done too often and we forget this and I actually forget this, so. Ready, quick little OOTD. Oh my gosh, and also my living room is a mess, but cozy and casual and warm is our motto today. A um, couple of jewelry, the hats, and then I'm probably gonna be wearing my Bottega. That is our outfits. Oh, these are all the colors you have, okay. Yes. We're gonna figure out colors. And we're gonna do like block, like bold colors. Mm -hmm. No, because mm -hmm. Like white, and then like halo, and then the, spe the orange specks, right? And then spray the purple, mm -hmm. and then do like bright white halo, like. Okay, around. Around yes. after. <laughs> and then on. the orange. Yes. Okay, I'm so excited. <laughs> it's like very clear. I don't know how we can achieve that. So I can mix this with okay. back to this. Okay, yes, yes, yes. yes. Um, are they fishes? I think so. Bugs. I don't know if they are bugs, maybe. Okay. I like this one. We could do the like red. the red. With the yellow? Like raised. We can mm -hmm. raise the red. perfect and fresh and I love them but after my nail appointment I've really been meaning to try three uncles for a very long time and I just like never went and still kind of warm um, and I am so excited you guys this is the roasted duck with rice um, and then I also got the lamb lamb dumplings so this is the lamb dumplings okay great Right, honey. I was gonna eat at the restaurant, but I really wanted to try it at home at the comfort of my own house. This is what she looks like. So I got the roasted duck and then the lamb dumplings. Ugh, both look so bomb. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? This is bomb. They were not even packed when I went. I think they're not packed on a weekday, obviously. I'm gonna try the lamb dumplings. Mm. Mm. If you love lamb, you will love this. I'm gonna take one more bite and then I'm gonna go watch a movie while I eat this delicious food. Definitely worth the wait of me starving myself to get this. See you later. Today we are going to do 
some last minute shopping. I really wanna stop by my favorite jewelry shop and try to find some new things um, before I head to my trip. Today I dressed a little bit cozier because it is cold outside. And I really wanna be warm and just like chill vibes. We're gonna go solo thrift, solo shopping day. Um, and we'll see what I find. Hopefully I find some good stuff and then we'll probably stop by for lunch um, at like this like Greek place by Portobello. I'll show you guys the outfit. I'm wearing systemic and yeah, very cozy, very warm. I'm actually very warm right now. I have a little bit of an undershirt underneath, which I hope will keep me warmer. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna probably wear my Bottegas. We're gonna head out. I also like strolling by Portobello whenever it's not as packed because it actually gets really chaotic. Whenever there's too many people, it's hard to kind of skimmer through. But I also might go to the market this weekend when it's packed and like all the vendors are around. Wait, this is not bad. So yeah, probably gonna do that. And what else? Earphones. Let's do a whole recap of my day. There was this one store that I went into. It was like jewelry heaven, you guys. It was a bit overwhelming the amount of things that they have, but I never ended up getting anything from that store because you had to ask the lady to bring out the jewelry for you to try out. So you really had to like pick which one you're gonna get. And you know, whichever one you had your eye on, but I had my eye on literally a lot of things. So it was hard for me to pick which ones I wanted to try. So I left and went to another jewelry store that had a lot more options laid out for me to pick and choose and wear. So I got a couple bangles. Um, I got these three, one in green, purple, and like a yellow gold. And I feel like to stack them would be really nice together with my other bangles. So yeah, I feel like that'd be perfect for Greece. And then I wanted more rings for my whole ring stack. I got this one. Can you see? So yeah, I got that one. And I also got this really pretty butterfly one. Are you kidding me? Uh, so I got those two. I love all the little shops that have a bunch of different gold jewelry because they're adjustable to whoever wants them. I'm a size five, so it's a bit hard for me to find rings that fit my size. I came home just in time. It is literally pouring outside. I think my favorite thing about going out and strolling around by myself is that I am a lot more open to conversing with people and I think it's one of my favorite things to do whenever I'm alone and actually makes my day a whole lot better whenever I meet new people and I chat with new people and I get to know a little bit of their lives because also I think they're more so open to sharing things about themselves whenever you're alone rather than if I'm with a friend maybe. Basically being inspired by everyone who's around you. Um, I like getting to know people a lot and getting to know about their lives and I feel like it adds something into mine and it adds like food for thought, you know? But yeah, I just want to put that out there because if you are not used to hanging out by yourself or if you don't enjoy your time alone, um, I feel like you need to do it more often for you to find ways to enjoy your time alone and hanging out with yourself. Um, I personally love my time alone. <laughs> um, I cherish it. And because I am so comfortable with my time alone, I'm also, I also enjoy the moments that I'm with my friends even more because I kind of get the best of both worlds. Um, Here. 
We are heading to the Arto Cavalli um, show. Not show. What the fuck? Show room. And then I think they have a little like cocktail so we can like drink a little bit. Hopefully the DJ is good so we can dance yeah. a little bit. We're only there to dance really. Yeah, but... we're only really there to <laughs> turn it up a little bit. But um, yeah, so we got ready for a TikTok. Do show your outfit? Yeah, let's show her outfits. This is Sunita's outfit. Oh my god. Okay, okay. Everything's probably thrifted. I'm not even gonna bother to ask. <laughs> She's the queen of thrifting. So yeah, let me close up for details. Yeah, so she got like the little cape. Like this belongs to the gala. Okay. The charity shop. Yeah. It's gonna be so funny if we're literally the most dressed in that yeah, showroom I'm because. Yeah. Like, casually. Exactly. But Sunita's is like, no, this is my it's time to shine. We I'm a star. I'm a motherfucking star. It's kind of gloomy outside. Hopefully it doesn't rain because we're planning on not bringing our jackets yep. because we're Ubering. So. I literally just checked into my hotel. I'm gonna give you guys a quick little overview of my hotel room and give you guys the views, okay? So starting off with like my patio area, I have this like whole staircase that kind of like leads down to my room. The sun actually sets this direction, so I'm able to see the sunset every day. And then here they serve breakfast in the mornings. This is where I'm gonna be eating. Over here is actually like the pool and you can open the window so you can kind of i don't know peek through outside and i just like love like the cave type of vibe so this is my room door and look how like cute and like just ah i love like the little character and like details of the wall and so like yeah you enter you can actually open this as well you enter and this is my room i love the caves and I love like the kind of washed yellow look of the room. It gives a lot of character and that's what I kind of wanted out of my room in Greece. I just love all the little details of the room as well. So you can kind of see the view from my room. So they have like cute little like vintage details of this room. I think, I don't know what this is. This is like a little vanity and oh, like come on. It is so cute, I love it. Um, so, got a little vanity. There's like these cute little details on the wall as well. We have a TV. Um, and then over here, I also have some like little fruits that I can eat and a whole glass, a whole bottle of champagne, you guys. Oh no, it's white wine. That's this little area over here. We have a little like vintage couch as well with the vintage wood and the flowers and then also like the, you can enter the pool through here as well. Well, actually, this is where you enter the pool and then the other one is like the window. But you guys, ah, so cute. And then my bed, I brought a pillowcase with me just because I'm just more comfortable sleeping in my own pillowcase knowing that I it's like washed properly and like, I don't know. I feel like I'm gonna start doing that a lot, but yeah, like I brought pillowcase. And look at this little area. It's also a little cute vanity. And 
Look at the little tissue holder. This is the little vanity where I can do my makeup and hair. I have a little closet. It has all my little towels that I can use, blow dryer, iron, robes, all of that good stuff. And then over here is a cute little like sink area. You can like wash or make some tea, hot coffee or whatever. I also have a fridge. And then, and then, and then. Okay, and then down here, you guys is a cute little staircase down to my bathroom and like just i'll show you so you go down da, 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 da. oh my god look. here is my shower my toilet and a little sink area and just oh my god it's so cute i like, feel like i'm in the dollhouse and come on it's so pretty and then the staircase oh but yeah i'm really excited I am gonna get ready and actually get something to eat because I'm hungry. And also I think I have about maybe barely four hours of sleep. I really can't complain because I, I am in Greece. And the fact that I've dreamt my whole life of being able to go here and it's about three hours away from London, crazy. Got ready into my signature look i'm gonna wear pants um and then i already have my little prada fur belt wearing this louisa Ballou halter and it has a little bag and then i'll show you i'll show you i'll show you i thrifted this pin from portobello and we're gonna add detail to the back so you know what i forgot to bring nipple covers yep i'm gonna add like this little cross by Looks like that. I don't know. I just like the added detail. I'm probably gonna wear my go-to chains, obviously. I've been seeing a lot of you guys wear it all over TikTok. And I'm so happy whenever I see people wear it. I'm gonna wear them without the cross this time. Why do I look like a box? What is going on? Literally, it's so windy outside, like I can hear the wind from inside. Okay, we're gonna cut my bangs because they're way too long. I don't like them. Project hair. I have a bigger pair of scissors. I like to turn it, so whenever I cut this um, side, I like to turn it the other way around. Okay, I think that's better. So whenever I take pictures, like I try to have this one. Oh my god! Bro. The way I reacted, yo. Ken. This, there's a cat. Did you see? Like, why is it just there? Okay, false alarm. <laughs> false alarm was actually a really sweet cat. So now I know to like always close my door because my door was literally open the whole time. I am just personally terrified of cats because some of them are literally the devil. I've never had a cat before, so I don't I don't know how they work. Anyways, we are gonna go try and take pictures. I forgot my rings at home. I didn't pack them. <gasps> like I was like, my hands are looking a little bit too bare. I think I'm gonna go walk around. It's actually windy and gloomy today. Thankfully, I brought a jacket with me um and like a little sweater so i should be all right but i it really is a bummer like i thought it was gonna be like really sunny but it's okay we're gonna walk around and see the little like areas around oh yeah yeah no yeah yeah You guys, it is so cold outside that I had I was literally bundled up in my jacket because of how cold it is. Like it is freezing. I love how like most of the people who are here as well, they're all dressed up for the summer, but then ha, everyone had to bundle up in like a jacket because of how cold it is. But I was gonna eat my dessert up there, but I, I requested them to bring my dessert down to my room so I can eat it here and actually be warm instead of being cold because this is also like ice cream, but I got the chocolate souffle with ice cream on the side and I'm gonna eat this while I probably watch some Korean show. I started Little Women and it's so good so if you guys haven't watched it, watch it but I'm gonna warm up. Before that though, I wanna show you guys what it looks like outside because it is so gorgeous. 
Like it looks even better at night, you guys. Like, come on. Look at this. Oh my gosh. So breakfast is served. I think we got some eggs and then toast, cheese. I actually don't like olives, but we're gonna try it today. Um, I think this is yogurt and some coffee and juice. What else is here? Oh, and we also have, I don't know what these are. So we're gonna try them. That is our breakfast. And Greece is, it actually rained last night. So this is kind of what it looks like out here. everybody I wanted to do my hair I want to do it differently for this look that I have I wanted it to be like this vibe but today is sunny but this morning it was like rainy I also want to go around the little markets that they have here and see what I can get because I like taking home little like knickknacks from every place that I visit so I try to look for things I don't really like getting fridge magnets it's not really my thing to collect fridge magnets but rather I like collecting home goods for the house that are like very um, unique to where I travel to. That was quick, but this is a hair. I thrifted these pair of earrings and look how cool they are. It almost looks like melted stone, but like so cute. This was like five pounds, you guys. Come on. Come on, Pardo Bello coming through always. Let me snap some pictures for us. It is day two of my trip and it is still raining. It was actually really nice this morning because the sun was out. They served breakfast outside and I just kind of like took that time to myself. But now it's raining and I feel like during the afternoon it rains a lot here. Uh, tomorrow I think it's supposed to be mainly sunny so that's like my last full day tomorrow is actually also my birthday so thank god it's actually not gonna be raining i'm gonna show you guys the outfit really quickly i am wearing this akoya swim top i'm also wearing the bottoms but i put on just like a parachute pair of pants so i can walk around and not be like naked inside and then the main part of the outfit is this kind of cover up like it goes all the way down to the floor but it's so pretty i took a picture in it already and come on and then the back yep then i just have my bangles like a whole stack of them i didn't pack my rings so i don't have rings today i think they're going to serve me lunch down here and have it be like a room service type vibe and then can i also do the burrata salad yes please perfect thank you so much God is on my side y'all it is freaking sunny now and oh my gosh gorgeous this is the view when it's like super sunny outside so they'll be serving my lunch right here okay, so the food came I got a burrata salad and um, a chicken linguine pasta and frozen margarita strawberry frozen margarita. So that is my lunch.
actually went to the grocery and I also got a little dessert from the spot that I stopped by. So I got tiramisu. Mm. And then I also got this sesame bar because the one that my hotel gifted me, I literally ate all of them already. It was really good. So I wanted more. And they're really crunchy and not super sweet, but like the right amount of sweetness. have been getting ready by my bed because we have no electricity so literally like downstairs is like completely dark so she is 26 I don't know what to feel about being 26 jump scare I didn't show you guys when I went on my cave pool but um, this like cave pool that I have in my Airbnb as well is so cute are you kidding me okay <gasps> electricity's back. I'm gonna go take some pictures because it is sunny today and God really be showing up for my birthday, okay? shops and probably get a massage so we're gonna go grab something to eat first even though i just had breakfast so i tried to kind of like clip my hair back because i don't want the wind to ruin my hair as much so damage control is what we're doing brought a little cardigan because it's windy chilling sitting by like a little area and it just like shows you the view of Greece like the whole view of Greece you guys it's beautiful you see the viewpoint of the whole island of Ia and I feel like during sunset would be like crazy up here so I might do that later to shoot right now i just propped up my camera and i got this tripod which is actually so compact it's probably the best phone tripod that i've ever purchased from amazon and it comes with a little remote so i have a little remote right here so it's a lot easier for me to like not go back and forth so have that set up this will be the view okay i'm gonna be right there and it's gonna be really pretty so i'm gonna get ready really quickly and figure out my hair and then i'll show you i just kind of like put my hair up instead of braiding it i just kind of like use some extensions have it be like a little bit curly undone as well so that is the hair but the outfit is this like mermaid freaking long red dress it just kind of matched the vibe that i wanted to go for but it goes all the way down to the floor i love i love a long skirt like a draped down long skirt and this just gives me exactly that i will tap back later but like look at this view as i'm taking pictures you guys can you see the pictures turned out really really good um i'll just show you a little sneak peek why not why not like look there's a lot now that we're done content i think i'm going to sit by my patio and watch the sunset while like reading a book oh. 
I forgot that I had my white wine that they gave me, so I think we're gonna drink that while we're watching the sunset and while I'm reading my book. I forgot how to open like a bottle of wine or a bottle of alcohol in general, period, because I'm not used to this life, so I'm not sure if they have like a bottle opener. Thank you so much. actually about to serve breakfast in about 10 minutes so last a little breakfast in Santorini so quickly we got some eggs out that she is hot um, I think that's like banana bread I think so got some ham and cheese yogurt orange juice and coffee it's about 9 a.m. right now, and I my flight's not till 5 p.m., so I don't have to book my transfer till like 3, I think, or like maybe like 2.30, but I'm probably gonna leave my suitcase with them, but, but I feel like yesterday was perfect. Even though it's windy, I can still enjoy the fact that the whole island is literally beautiful. But I think my next like big travel might be Tokyo um, but during the summertime I do want to go around Europe a lot so I'm probably gonna go to like Italy like parts of Italy Spain maybe definitely I just finished breakfast. A lot of you guys have been wanting to know where I stayed and I want to do a little rundown of all the details of how I even got here. But I am in Castro Oya Houses. I think that's like the whole name of their hotel. And they also have the Castro Oya restaurant, which is literally like upstairs. I'm not quite sure what the name of my specific room is, but they do have other rooms with different kind of views and different interior. Overall, 10 out of 10, they serve breakfast every morning and you also do get the view of the sunset so it faces sunset and then their other rooms I think might face the sunrise so overall a really great stay um, I love the interior decorations of this specific hotel I also feel like it's a perfect spot for like a solo trip um, if you guys are thinking about it because everything is pretty much like in the island of Ia you got shops you got grocery little mini markets and then you also have all of the restaurants the cafes around here that's all walkable so this is my first official like solo travel that I've done and I do not regret it. I love my own company. So you gotta nurture your solo time and your alone time and the best way to nurture it is to travel to like a safe, you know, safe area, safe place. Just vibe out by yourself and just spend some alone time and do it all yourself. I feel like some of us might wait on other people before we go travel because you know like we don't want to go alone da, 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 da. and I felt like that for a very long time up until obviously I moved to London all by my own and that just kind of like opened doors for me just doing anything and everything that I want because I realized I can literally do everything by myself and enjoy it by myself. But yeah, highly recommend. Um, I am going to start packing because I actually have to check out at 10 a.m. and it's currently 9.30.